Hi, welcome back with me plant do home and garden. This time, I'll give you video about 10 popular pond plants. Well, before go to the video, don't forget to like and subscribe for supports this channel. Also, you can turn on the bell for more updated videos. Okay, let's go to the video. Number 1. Creeping Jenny. Often used as a ground cover in terrestrial gardens, Creeping Jenny fares excellently when used in water gardening applications. Growing approximately 2 inches in height, it's a great filler to soften edges of rocks with its bright leaves creating a vivid contrast against the cool gray of wet stone. Tiny yellow flowers appear on the plant throughout summer, giving it added appeal. Creeping Jenny is a perennial and best used in zones 3 to 10. Number 2. Pickerel. Available in blue, white, and pink lavender spiked flowers, pickerel is a great choice for ponds with its shiny, green heart-shaped foliage. The blooms are long-lasting and create a beautiful display when planted in masses. It grows about 2430 in height and performs well in zones 4 to 10. Number 3. Horsedale. Horsedale reed provides a striking architectural presence in your pond with its segmented reeds, growing to 2-4 in height, while the dwarf version grows to 8. Hardy to zone 4, it's a fast spreader and you'll want to thin the plant in the summer. In the fall, cut the plant all the way down to the ground to keep the spores from spreading. Number 4. Taro. Several varieties of taro are available for your pond and do well in full to part sun. This is a tropical plant suited for zones 8 to 11, but colder climes can bring the plant inside during the winter months. This impressive, leafy water lover grows to about 4-8 and always makes a striking appearance in the water garden. Number 5. Cardinal Flower. Plant this pretty flower along the shallow edges of your pond and watch the birds flock to it. Deep burgundy foliage sets off the vibrant red flowers. The leaves are up to 8 long and the plant can grow as tall as 3 feet. Cardinal flower performs best in zones 5 to 9. Number 6. Water Lettuce. Water lettuce produces fuzzy, lime green rosettes of leaves that look like little floating heads of lettuce. Super easy to grow, you simply let this plant float on the surface of the water with its roots dangling below. They produce babies throughout the summer and can be shared with friends or moved to container water gardens. Hardy in zones 9 to 11. Number 7. Mosaic Plant. The beautiful mosaic plant consists of red and green diamond-shaped leaves in 3-6 wide rosettes. In the summer, this floating plant produces sunny yellow cup-shaped flowers. Easy to grow, the plant provides a place for your finned friends to hide underneath. A tropical plant, mosaic is hardy in zones 11 to 12. Number 8. Blue Iris. Many water gardeners enjoy the elegant splendor of the aquatic iris, which is among the first plants to bloom in the spring. Aquatic irises comprise such a large and diverse group, there are literally hundreds, if not thousands of cultivated and natural hybrids. The blue flag iris is a native plant that can grow up to 4 feet tall. A wetland lover, the blue flag's large flowers are breathtaking, ranging in shades from pale blue to purple. Number 9. Sweet Flag. Also known as Golden Japanese Sweet Flag, Acris gramineus ogon, this plant is ideal for containers and water gardens alike. It's extremely flexible, as it can be grown with its toes in the water or partially submerged. The beautiful foliage is light green and highlighted with bright yellow stripes, remaining beautiful all season and sometimes through the winter. An all-around great plant that adds a bright, cheerful spot to any water feature. Number 10. Water Lilies. Water lilies are stunning creatures in the water garden and often the reason why many gardeners add a pond to their landscape. These beautiful pond plants are characterized by amazing flowers representing all colors in the light spectrum red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet, including the collective white, and a number of shades in between. The flowers range from a mere two in diameter to some blooms measuring one two or more. Their leaves typically float unless they're crowded and are more or less round, ranging from two across to over six feet for the giant Victoria. Water lilies are perennial and can be broken down into two basic groups, hardy and tropical. Thanks for watching my video about 10 popular pond plants. 
If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe for supports our channel. Well, see you in the next videos.